Welcome back guys. In this tutorial we will discuss about the world largest engine which is designed by the Versola and named as RTFlex 96C which have an output of 80,080 kW and it consists of 14 cylinders. So as we will move forward in this video we will discuss about this engine material, crank arrangement, adaptation for 14 cylinder and Vertela RTFlex common rail system. So before starting, as I say in every video, please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get updated to new technology. Guys, I don't like to say that, but what can I do? This is the rule of YouTube game. So let's move on. The world's first 14-cylinder low-speed engine entered in service on 1st September 2006 in a large first container vessel developed by Vasella Corporation. The 14-cylinder Versella RTFlex 96C engine is also world's most powerful engine with an output of 80,080 kW, which run on 102 RPM. The 14-cylinder Versella RTFlex 96C engine is a major breakthrough for ship propulsion. It extends the power available to suit a new generation of large container ships while combining the benefits of proven. Reliable engine design with the complex flexibility of RTFlex common rail technology. Traditionally, low speed marine engines have been built with maximum of 12 cylinders. However, when it was recognized some years ago that a mass container ship will need more than was available from existing RTA 96C and RTFlex 96C low speed engine, a solution was founded to extend. The power of engine ranges to 80,080 kW by offering also 13 and 14 cylinder engines. The 14 cylinder engine RTFlex 96C is thus based on already well established 12 cylinder RTFlex 96C design, which itself developed by the firm RTA 96C engine type widely application in container ships since 1998. It does benefit from the wealth of service experience with engines of the same type. To date there are more than 300 RTFlex 96C and RTA 96C engine in service are on order to worldwide. Now we will see adaptation for 14 cylinder. Extensive consideration was nevertheless given to the practically of increase the number of cylinder and ensure that engine was everyone expectation in the term of safety, reliability and durability. With regard to the engine structure, the opportunity had already been taken when adopting RTA 96C engine type accommodate the RTFlex common rail system to introduce a 10 modification in all cylinder number of better manufacture. These changes also resulted in gather stiffness and reduced stress in structure. The revision also took into account uh, the 14 cylinder engine to ensure that they had adaptive structure strength and rigidity without further modification. The crank of RTFlex 96C has sufficient torque capacity for 14 cylinder the material having been upgraded to enable an increased sink fit for a greater design marine. The thrust braking structure in the RT Flex 96C engine was a mid-gear driven by the has been resolved to reduce deformation and stresses even when the increased thrust in the 14-cylinder engine when the vessel is equipped with a shaft motor. So next we will see Versella RTFlex common rail system. The Fuderly electronic control Versella RTFlex 96 common rail system of 14 cylinder engine being imported benefit to the ship owner. It gives unrevealed flexibility in the way the engine operated resulting the smokeless operation at all operation speed. Lower fuel consumption reducing maintenance cost and lower steady operating speed for the battery fit manufacturing. The RT Flex also has potential to adaptation of further needs. A visual feature of 14 slider RT Flex 96C is modest size of the compact supply unit compared with overall dimension of the engine. And the absence of full length 
camshaft usually mechanically controlled engine the supply unit with the fuel and servo oil supply pumps is on the engine side at the mid length on the mid gear drive there are two identical rail units which for seven cylinder along the side of the cylinder tops thanks for watching this video with tons of love to my instant learner family and to be instant learner family this is me engineer bilal we'll see you in next video goodbye